So today we're going to talk about how to use egg yolks, okay, to prevent gallstones. Now I know you're saying, what? Are you kidding me? Egg yolks? That's going to cause gallstones, right? Actually not. Let's talk about really what causes gallstones. It's a combination of high cholesterol, decreased bile salts, a decrease in phosphatidylcholine. And by the way, this is just a compound that has choline in it that makes up your cell walls. It's also intimately involved in keeping cholesterol from forming into a cholesterol stone, which is a gallstone. So this is very, very important. And guess what? This compound is in egg yolks. Out of all the foods, it's highest in egg yolks. That's why egg yolks will not cause gallstones. It's also in soybean oil, which we don't want to do because it's GMO. You can consume it in grass-fed liver and peanuts, but egg yolks is a good source. That's the connection. Number four, if your gallbladder is sluggish and things aren't moving through that well, it can accumulate and form stone. Number five, if you have a decreased transit time of your colon, let's say you have constipation. Why? Because the gut flora help you recycle the bile several times when you're eating. So if we get a bile deficiency, that can cause the problem right there. And number six, you don't have enough gut flora. Uh, let's say you took antibiotics. It increases your risk for getting gallstones. Another reason why someone might not have enough bile salts is they have high insulin, okay? Because they're on a high carb diet. Or they have liver damage because bile is made in your liver. Not, it's stored in the gallbladder. It's not made in the gallbladder, but it's made in the liver. And if you don't have the capacity of liver function, you're not gonna have enough bile. Increases the risk of getting gallstones. Okay, um, you can also have not just fatty liver, but cirrhosis of the liver as well and have that same problem. And I already mentioned the gut flora. If you don't have enough gut flora, you're gonna actually not gonna have enough bile. So you just have to realize that gallstones are created by something. And a lot of things can contribute to these stones. There's a higher incidence of getting gallstones when you're diabetic. Why? Because the high insulin. This is a very important thing to actually lower to prevent gallstones. You can take bile salts to help dissolve gallstones. Or you have the option of taking phosphatidylcholine by itself or just getting it from your diet. And if you don't have a gallbladder, you are going to be deficient. So you're going to need to take bile salts as a supplement. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. So if you're enjoying this content, go ahead and share it with someone that could really benefit from it.